11. It's one of nine of the Coast Guard's ice-breaking cutters in the Great Lakes. Mobile Bay pulled into Houghton this morning on a mission to break the ice. But as it turns out, they didn't have any to break. TV6's Kelly Gibbs reports. Since December, the Coast Guard cutter Mobile Bay has had a busy schedule, but now the ice breaking season is wrapping up. Uh, it's actually December, and uh, it's ending now. We've been all over uh, Lake Michigan, Straits of Mackinac, St. Mary's River, and Lake Superior. We have what's called Operation Taconite. In these areas, the cutter's mission is most commonly to facilitate maritime commerce throughout the Great Lakes by breaking up the ice and allowing smaller vessels to pass through the water. One of the most unique aspects of the ship is that we have what's called an air lubrication system, or what we like to call the bubbler system, and that basically uh, has um, very pressurized air that is released underneath the, uh, the water level and that allows for an extra lubrication between the ice and the hull. Their living quarters are tight, hours are long, but many of the men say the food is a perk of the job. We had filet mignon the other night, we had pork chops for lunch, uh, eggs every morning, eggs and bacon. But even with good food on board, it isn't enough to keep thoughts of family and friends at bay. You know, there's honeydews at home, there's bills to be paid, there's you know, stuff that stuff that needs just to be taken care of around the house. Right for right, right? And the good news is the men will soon be getting a break for two weeks. The crew plans to leave for Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin within the next two to three days, and they plan on being home at the end of next week. Kelly Gibbs, TV6 News, Houghton.